Hello viewers. In this video, we will see the solution for software project management, week 11 assignment level. First question: Which one of the following best reflects the focus of quality total quality management? Management engineering. Uh, now the answer for this is. TQM advocates continuous process improvements through process measurement. So you can see here, uh, it is from product assurance to process assurance. So answer is process assurance, option A. Process assurance. B. Which one of the following ISO quality assurance standard applies to software development? Organizations. So, next one. So, 9001, ISO 9001, applicable to most software development organizations. It is engaged in design, development, production, and servicing of goods. So, answer is 9001, option B. I used to 9001. Third, and a software organization has been assessed at SEI CMM level 4. Which one of the following does the organization need to achieve to satisfy one of the KPAs of CMM level 5? So that will be, so there are five levels, initial, repeatable, defined, managed and optimizing CMM levels. So regarding KPS, level 5 KPS defect prevention. Defect prevention. Option B, defect prevention, which one of the following can be considered to be the focus of quality control, fourth one, so fourth one, Quality control basic principle not only detect the defective products and eliminate them, but also determine the causes behind the defects. Fourth one. So detecting and removing defects from the product. Yes. Which one of the following is expected to be observed in software development organization assessed at the EICMM repeatable level? Fifth one. So, level two is repeatable. Basic product management practices, tracking cost and sh schedule exist. Uh, size and cost estimation development process is adopted and this is so more more about repeatable level two earlier success on projects with similar applications can be repeated opportunity to repeat process exists when a company produces a family of products So answer is success in the development of a software project can be repeated on a similar software development projects. The organization has defined procedures that enable it to repeat past project success in similar B and E. In CMMI, which one of the following is the name of maturity level five? 
सिक्स एंड सेवन आर सेम सिक्स एंड सेवन बोथ आर सेम सो विल सी सिक्स एंड सेवन सिक्स एंड सेवन सो इट इज वन सेकेंड इट गो टू दिस सो ऑप्टिमाइजिंग CMM5 is optimizing. So sixth and seventh option D optimizing. Seventh also option D optimizing. Eighth one, which of the following summarizes an important difference between quality assurance and quality control? So eighth one. ऑप्शन <laughs> production process it is about the process not directly about the product so answer is quality assurance focuses on process improvement while quality control focuses on defect in products so e e and uh, quality assurance indicates audit and process compliance while quality control includes inspection and testing g Ninth one, which one of the following is CMM is is EI CMM maturity level should be recommended to a small startup company that focuses on outsourced software development and software maintenance work? So it is uh, level two. Level two, can level two. And the uh, last one is tenth one. so which of the following statements about statistical testing are true so about statistical testing we can see so statistical quality control inspection or testing of all processes is cumbersome and many times not feasible quality of the output of the process is inferred using statistical methods so the answer is uh statistical testing techniques are applied to estimate software reliability c statistical testing are applied to predict the number of failures likely to occur during product software operation under given usage statistical testing techniques are applied to completely replace function not that one uh, r to h statistical testing uh, techniques are used to provide quantified confidence level in the correctness of the software so answer uh, likely answer are c e and uh, h c e h statistical statistical testing techniques are applied to predict the number of failures likely to occur during software operation under given usage condition and hg statistical testing techniques are used to provide a quantified confidence level in the correctness of the software thank you viewers